Hello, my name is Danek and uh, today I want to show you how you can create a DigitalOcean proxies with createproxy.com. It is super easy and everybody can do it. So, uh, first of all, uh, in create proxy you can, you can uh, click on DigitalOcean and then click on add account. As you can see, our uh, only requirement is DigitalOcean APK. So uh, you will need DigitalOcean account. Uh, Google for DigitalOcean 100 free credit. So you can get 100 free credit uh, that you will need to spend in 60 days. Uh, sign up for an account and uh, once you once you have an account we will see what i see right now what you will need uh, to do in uh, digital ocean uh, to get uh, a apk is uh, that you will need to click on api right here and uh, in api uh, token, tokens and keys just click on uh, generate new key, new token. Enter whatever name you want and uh, make sure you have checked uh, right and uh, click on generate token. Once you have your token, just copy this token and uh, paste in Cryptoxy. Insert name of uh, of uh, this uh, account in Cray Proxy and uh, click on Add DigitalOcean Account. All done. So you can now start creating proxies with uh, your DigitalOcean uh, account. If you need more accounts, you can uh, repeat this action. And then you can select uh, the accounts that you have created uh, for digital option here. Select uh, data center location. I want to create uh, proxies in Frankfurt. Uh, select the instance. Select how many how many proxies you want to create. I want to create two. Select default port and uh, select. Uh, Select the security for your proxies. If you want to secure your proxies with a login or a validus, I want to secure my proxies with uh, with uh, username and password. You can uh, you can change these uh, username and password with your own if you want to, and then just click on uh, create DigitalOcean proxies. So the proxy has been created and now we need to wait for create proxy to finish uh, all the installations on your uh, new servers. So your proxies are ready and we can start using them. As you can see, you have received uh, many proxies. We have created two instances and you have 35, 36 uh, proxies. This is because each of your, your DigitalOcean instances uh, receive uh, 16 uh, IPv6 proxies. So uh, 
every of your instance uh, receive uh, 69 v 6 proxies sorry uh, then uh, one HTTP proxy and one SOX5 proxy and every instance uh, have the same same uh, amount of proxies so let's let's try these proxies let's try HTTP proxy So as you see, it's working. Let's try IPv6 proxy that has been created as well with every instance. It's working. And uh, Let's try our proxies in uh, in uh, in browser. So let's uh, select uh, uh, some uh, IPv6 proxy and let's try this IPv6 proxy with browser. So as you see it's working and uh, this is my current IP address so let's uh, turn on uh, IPv6 address and reload the page and as you see it's working my browser is now using IPv6 address we can try we can try 65 proxy of one of our instance in a browser I'm going to enable the SOX5 proxy and re uh, reload the page. As you see, we are using uh, IPv4 address and uh, SOX5 is working. So, everything is working now. Uh, you can use out management for DigitOcean as well. You can uh, create new uh, category or you can use any of your existing categories and uh, just click on add cloud credentials select digital ocean select the proxy type for you want to create uh, proxies if you want to create ipv6 uh, credentials then you can select uh, any of your ipv6 proxy i want to try my ipv4 http proxy you can select automatic expiration that means uh, if you select like 24 uh, then this credentials will stop working after after one day you can select uh, how you want to secure these credentials if you want to secure your, your credentials by IP address you can select the IP addresses here so only these IP addresses may use uh, these credentials and uh, they don't need to insert uh, username and password it will work without username and password or you may secure your, your credentials with uh, login so 
so uh, username and password is required I want to insert my my name and as password I want to use my surname so let's try as you see this proxy will expire room on my day and uh, and uh, let's try this proxy from Germany so we'll just copy it usually take one to two minutes before auto management uh, will be will be working if you add new credentials then it's take one to two minutes So it's working now uh, my username and password is working so that's how it's work I hope you like it uh, there is a video how to use DigitalOcean uh, with automatization so create proxy may create automatically for your servers and automatically delete your servers after a specific time uh, there is uh, also a tutorial about the routers so you may use uh, any of your sources including DigitalOcean uh, for uh, rotating and stuff like that uh, you can also sell your DigitalOcean proxies on, on Create Proxy Marketplace and uh, that's all from me uh, thank you for watching and see you in the next video